Nile Rodgers, and Disclosure. It's sort of like the, the ultimate combo package of like hit making people right here. This is kind of crazy. Well, what, all of you, yes. Oh, come on. You've already worked together, everything's great. What does it feel like tonight? I mean, you guys have been here before, you've been here a bunch of times before. Have you been to the Grammys before? I came last year. Last year, I was here last year, but um, this year's a big year, especially for Sam, you know, it's his night and we're all here to support him and it's yeah. gonna be amazing, fingers crossed. Um, I wanna know, I mean, you guys are working on new music right now, I think. Um, I think you guys talked about that when we did our cover story with you a year ago. Um, how's the new music coming along? It's great, yeah, we've been working with a bunch of people. Um, no one we can mention as of Anyone yet. on the stage right now with us, perhaps? Well... <laughs> this is awkward, man. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of people here, yeah. Definitely. We, we live for this stuff. It's like, tell us, please spill all the beans now. I think it's, we'll keep the surprises to a minimum. But, um, yeah, we've, I think what we keep saying is, I think one of the reasons that people liked the last album, if they did like it, was because we brought forward like quite a lot of new people, like when Sam, before he was big, and like London Grammar and a few other people. So we don't just want to like go for the big names like now just because we can. We want to do like a bit of that and then bring some new people forward as well. So it's going to be a similar idea to the last one in that respect. But musically, we you know, can't really say too much yet. But yeah. And you made me famous too. They made me famous with a nice sort of <laughs> jazzy, cool underground track. Sure. Brought me back. So you know, I, I, I thank you guys. It was really cool, man. We felt like Niall really needed our help. <laughs> he did. He needed your help in the you know the career department because you know he he he'd fallen on some hard times. You know, uh, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Um, Niall, I want to know if you had to ask a question of the Disclosure Boys, men, boys to men, what would you ask them right now? Um, so, how exactly did you feel about these the ascending chords that I put at the end of? Uh, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's my kind of question, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I would describe them as incredibly expensive. Yeah, yeah they call yeah, they yeah. call them the million dollar chords. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, kind of a silly question, but what was your morning like? What was your ritual this morning? Like, did you sleep in late? Did you have a good breakfast? No, nah, we were all awake pretty early. It was felt like Christmas Day. Like I said, it's like Christmas Day, but you don't know if you're going to get the presents. <laughs> so it's quite exciting in that respect. Um, yeah, my day so far consisted of setting up a DJ booth and a lot of lights for the party later. <laughs> um, you ate some cereal. Cereal was good. You, as you do. Uh, yeah, I ate some breakfast. Yeah, it was good. it was great. Um, last thing, then I'll let you go. What were you listening to in the car on the way over? Uh, we were listening to Kendrick Lamar. Yeah. Yeah, we felt like we did it last year. I think it's become a thing. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's not working if it is, but. Um, <laughs> Wait, has your category best dance recording been announced already? Yeah. Yeah, no, no good news this year, I'm afraid. I still love that track, though. We should switch from Kendrick. Yeah. <laughs>